Hey everyone, I'm Nog and welcome back to Factorio. We are kind of okay, we're on power for now. Uh, let's have a quick look. We're doing okay, but we're not researching. So once we start researching, I guess it will go a little bit bad again, but we are going to start researching uh, because we need to get more damage out of our lasers. So let's start the shooting speed here. And then we also need our portable fusion reactors and our personal robo ports and a whole lot of other stuff. So we're going to get working on that. But first things first, we need to start making our pro production science packs. And We've already started setting it up, so we have, what, seven uh, fact uh, assemblers uh, building our uh, pro productivity modules that we need. All we need to do is hook them up to some um, inserters, and we don't need fast inserters for this, we just need regular. So let's set that up. Oops, don't need two of them. And there. That a bit further. And let's get them out of there as well and get them onto our belt. There we go. And that doesn't need to be there. So we should have some. Uh, what are they called again? The productivity modules going and we do very nice so we have productivity modules we also need rails and we need electric furnaces and rails are going to be on their own line so we need to get elect electric furnaces going in on the other side here so what do we need to make that we need steel plate advanced circuits and stone brick so that's three products that we need for that, which means that we can't just stick them on the other side. Oh, we could. Yeah, we can. We can. So let's do that. And how many of them do we need? So we need one per production cycles, and we need seven production cycles. So that's seven units producing. Or do we actually need seven? This takes 21 seconds for a production cycle. This only takes five. Hmm. We actually don't need that many uh, productivity modules either. So if we do four, that's 20. Right? Am I doing my math right? Yeah, so four will produce 20. Electric furnaces a second and no. What the hell am I camp calculating here? Oh my math just quit. Uh, let's see. We need one a second. So that's five of these. But if we do one a second. need three of these production cycles seven fourteen twenty one right so yeah which means that we need four of them five of them let's just do five I can't do math right now we might change it later. <laughs> Okay, um, so we need to bring our, oh, what is that doing? No, definitely don't need that doing that. Okay, there we go. And do we have a mixed belt here? I hope not. 
doesn't look like it. Good. All right, so we need advanced circuits coming in here. There. Let's see. Okay, there. We need advanced circuits and we need stone brick and we'll put those on the same line. And it will be the second line. And then we need steel plate on the inner line. Steel plate will go in on its own. So there we go. And go under. And let's just pull it out to so there. Fine. And we need the red circuits. They're there. And then we need stone brick, which is there. All right, and we need red circuits and stone brick to go on the same line. So let's see, have that come down here. We'll have that come down here. And let's just check that I have everything right. There. There we go. Whoops. There we go. And there's destroying stuff again. Man, stop destroying my stuff. Okay. So, 10 steel plate, 5 advanced circuits, 3 stone brick. Okay. So, we need 2 to come up here. We need to come up here. And we need to come up here. And then this needs to split out like so so that should be our steel going yes it is all right and then we need a line going up here we'll just pull it under here There's something wrong here because there should be four. So this is probably the line where we have a bit of a problem. We'll fix it later. Don't want to deal with it now. And I'm an idiot and I didn't put this in first. So now I can go up here and grab all of these red circuits so that we don't get red circuits on both sides of the belt. There we go. Because we need this to go under here. And then we need to split this out and get the stone bricks going in there. All right. And then we need, I do think we need fast inserter for, for this. So we'll do that. And we need some long-handed inserters. There. And we need some regular inserters for the output. There we go. And then all we need is some power. So let's power it up. There we go. And of course we need some lights as well. And we actually need quite a few lights. We do have lights there, we don't have lights here. And let's put this one on the other side so it's even. And we'll put lights like this, I think. There we go! Alright. So that's two of our needed products that we are producing and we are getting the electric furnaces on the belt. Very nice. Now all we need is some rail. And for rail we need stone, steel and iron sticks. And iron sticks we need to produce. We need 30 a minute. Or 30 a second. No we don't. We need. So 
one of these takes 30 rail and takes 21 minutes or 21 seconds to produce. I keep saying minutes, I don't know why. And we need seven of these productions. So that means we need a crap ton of rails. Uh, we need two, three, four, five. Five assemblers producing rails. So let's see if we can do that. One, two, three, four, oops, four, five. So let's produce rails. There we go. And we'll have the output here. So. And we will have the input here. And we'll have two mesh, two lines, because we need three different products. Actually, oh crap, we need to change this. Let's just try all this out, because we need to actually make the iron rods. And stuff is almost dead over here. Let's just uh, fix that up real quick before it actually gets dead. There we go. All right. So we have the output, and that actually needs to change as well. Whoops. I didn't want to tear that belt out. There we go. Okay. So we need the iron to come out. Let's just pull everything out, I think. Uh, not everything, but some of it. There we go. Do not put the copper on that line. We need stone as well, which we have here. And we need steel which we already have going. All right, so first things first, we need to produce some iron sticks. And we produce two every half second. So that's, and we need what? We need one for each of these, which is a bit weird, but okay, we need one. And we need five rail productions, which means we need two and a half. Uh, let's just say three assemblers producing iron sticks. The iron sticks are easy. So let's do like this. And we will put the splitter in here and get it going. Whoops. There we go. And we need fast inserters, fast inserters, and an output. Whoops, other way. There we go. And we need some power. And some light. Okay. So iron sticks are coming in. All right. So we'll put the iron sticks together with the steel plate, I think. Yeah, let's do that. And the steel plate will be coming up here. So let's just like this like that and we need the steel sticks coming up here and we'll turn this around and get this going 
All right. And I need it coming in on the other side. So there. There we go. We have your plate coming in. Hold on just one second, guys. Sorry about that, guys. I am back. Okay, so we have the steel sticks and the or iron sticks and steel plate coming in. Now we just need some stone, which we will get. Don't need stone bricks. We just need stone there. So we'll run this under. Actually. Let's just do like that. And the stone will come up here. Oops. Like that. And the stone will run up like this and come in right next to this. All right, then we need our assemblers for, we can't get an output here, darn it. All right, so we'll do that after. And there we go, the light is flickering again. Fantastic. Okay. We really need to fix this power problem once and for all. And we will, just not right now. All right, so there, and this will be, and you need to make steel iron sticks as well, and this will be rails, there we go, that's the rail production going. don't like but the power flickering like that I really really don't uh, let's see you there 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 oops wrong one there we go and long-handed There we go, and we have our uh, rails coming in. And we actually need to get that on both sides, because we need quite a lot of it. So let's just do that real quick. Uh, actually, let's do it down here. Down there, and it'll come in here. And like that. All right. So rails are being produced. Uh, electric furnaces are pre being produced. And productivity units are being produced. Which means that all we need to do now is set up our production of the science packs. So let's do that. And we'll do that here, I think. Yeah, let's do it here. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven. And this can just run straight. Actually, no, it cannot. I'll pick all this off. Because we want the rails on the inside. Because we need many more of those than we do the others. So, whoops. Rails. Coming in here. And then we'll just give this a little turn and do like that. All right. And we're out of belt. But luckily, we are producing belt right here. Oops. Don't stand on the line. Let's grab that. And get this going. Then we need 
just need regular inserters. Actually, we need fast inserters for these, I think. Even though it takes quite a while, let's just do fast inserters. Doesn't really matter that much. And then we need some long handed. Whoops. There we go. And we definitely just need regular for the output. There. And some power. And some light. Let's just do like that. And more power. There we go. And you make some production science. That should do it. Let's see. Will they start producing? And we are out of power. Again. Shit. Okay, we have power again. Good. So yeah, they are producing. And we will be getting production science. Very nice. But before we start putting it into our uh, science labs and stuff, we need to fix the power problem. So that is what we're going to do in the next episode. But for now, we have production science being produced. So thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and maybe subscribe. And I'll see you next time.